In a tranquil village nestled between rolling hills, there lived a wise old man named Takashi. He was known throughout the land for his serene demeanor and unshakable sense of peace. People came from far and wide seeking his counsel, hoping to glean a fraction of his wisdom. One day, a young and brash warrior from a neighboring village arrived at Takashi's humble abode. Fueled by ego and bravado, the warrior challenged Takashi to a duel of words, seeking to prove his superiority. Old man, he taunted, I've heard of your supposed wisdom. Let's see if you can match wits with me. Takashi looked at the young warrior with kind eyes, his face unruffled by the challenge. He invited the warrior to sit and share tea with him. As they sat, Takashi began to pour tea into the warrior's cup. And he kept pouring, even as the tea began to overflow onto the table. The warrior, frustrated by Takashi's seemingly foolish act, exclaimed, Stop! What are you doing, old man? Can't you see the cup is full and can't hold any more tea? Takashi calmly set down the teapot and looked at the warrior. Indeed, he said, just as your mind is full of preconceptions and reactions. How can you expect to learn anything new if your mind is already overflowing with what you think you know? The warrior, taken aback by the insight of Takashi's words, realized that he had approached the situation with a closed mind. He had reacted impulsively without considering the potential for growth and understanding. His arrogance had prevented him from truly listening and learning. Touched by the lesson, the warrior bowed to Dakashi and thanked him for the wisdom he had imparted. He left the village with a newfound sense of humility and a desire to approach life with an open heart and mind. As the years passed, the warrior transformed into a wise and respected leader in his own right, known for his ability to listen, learn, and respond thoughtfully rather than reacting impulsively. And he often told the story of his encounter with the old man who had taught him the power of not reacting, a story that continued to inspire generations to come.